of blue paint, same tire tracks, no doubt about it, the killer's car was here. I think we have to find the, uh, the old human remains though. Just, just turn around. There we go. Notice how that bulldozer is stopped in the background. I think this is it here. Yeah. And wait for it. There it is. One of your cop buddies asking too many questions. I had to solder up his little mouth. Hands on your head, pig. I ain't got time to be playing around with you. Let's just get you out of sight and finish you off. Down. Down. Ooh. Ouch. Ooh, get up. Mash the button. Grab the gun. He's got the gun. Don't move. Enough fucking around. You're gonna tell me about the man with the blue car. Go fuck yourself in the ass. Charming. I have no time to lose, Jack. I wanna know who that car belongs to. What you want, don't this guy's accent is fantastic. You better just lock me up now, boy. Impress. Ooh! You out of your motherfucking mind, man? Oh shit, Jack. Ain't nothing to it. Just a little bit of self-defense. Page one of the police manual. Kill or be killed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. Stop enough. I'm starting to remember some things. You, you be cool. Uh, I'll tell you the tale. I don't know nothing about the guy. He wanted me to get rid of his dirty car, get him a new one with false plates. He paid cash, and I ain't the questioning kind. Said I was. Thought he was going to impress him with information. Paco down at the Blue Lagoon when the car was done. Now that's all I know. We'll continue this discussion down at the station. You're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything. Oh, here we go. I need to be quick on the old quick time events. Anything you say can and will be. Hey, <laughs> you look like you got a problem, man. X. I want. Oh, God, circle. Oh, how the fuck? Oh, bollocks! What? They letting you dope heads in the FBI now? God bless them. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. Now I'm going to give you a little help with your gun problem, Mr. Favo. Permanently. Bollocks. This isn't going to bode well. Now I've done this before, and successfully too. There's a stupid amount of fucking quick time events. Oh god. Yeah. 
Go, 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 go. Triangle. Get out. Yeah, I'm free. Ha ha. Up. Hooray, I'm free. Oh, bollocks. That way. What? Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh. Oh. Why are they giving me stupid quick time events that are impossible to do under pressure? That way. That way again. Uh. Oh god. What's with these overlong fights? go. Ooh. Oh, I hate, I hate those overlong fight sequences. They're just not necessary. Yeah. And the fucking stupid pressing down all the buttons. They have to do some kind of weird contortions or have eight foot long fingers to be able to do. Stupid. So, you think the origami killer killed Manfred? That makes sense. Didn't want him spilling his guts to us. And you suspect Gordy Kramer, right? Oh, him or one of his men. Gordy has the time and the means, not to mention the fucked up attitude to go along with it. He's only a suspect, but he's a pretty guilty looking one. Are these your files on the case? Yeah, I've been working on them for a couple of years. Uh, I built up a mountain of paperwork. Magazines about origami? You think <clears throat> the killer could have subscribed to one of those? If he was even remotely interested in origami in the last 30 years, his name may be in there somewhere. The trouble is, there's over 500 names. I guess a squat. I'm starving. Can I don't know what I'm doing? doing. Well, I'm no chef, but I should be able to make some scrambled eggs if you like. Great. I'm soaking wet. I need to warm up a little. Is it okay if I take a shower? I'll be my guest. Go to my bedroom. It's the next door. Oh, I'll cook up the eggs while you're under the shower. Oh, that's that's his bedroom, right?
do like scrambled eggs. Bit of cheese and some toast. What? Beautiful. I don't know what I'm doing. Just let them cook for a bit. Eggs should be ready by now. Huh. It's more like an omelette, really. I took the liberty of borrowing your bathrobe. Looks better on you. Hey, that almost looks good enough to eat. Ha. Uh. What's that? The notebook I took from Manfred's place. According to this, about 30 clients bought spare parts for oh, I've been sat in a very time. odd position for a long time. Oh, you know, checking out the alibi of 30 clients one by oh. one. Oh. Ouch. That's a lot of leg work. Except that if we cross-check them with the list. The list of subscribers to Origami Magazines. You still got that, right? Yeah, yeah, of course. But Lord, wait. Aren't you gonna eat your food? Hang on, I was taking a sip. If the killer really used a royal typewriter, and if he subscribed to an origami magazine, his name should be on both lists. Well, Lauren, uh, I mean, that's just an assumption, but yeah, I suppose. His name is here somewhere. Help me, we're gonna find him. Why are you drinking with both hands? The only guy whose name is on both lists died when he was 10. What are you gonna do now? Dig up his coffin, make sure he's dead? I know it doesn't make any sense. Unless the killer was only using his name. But why use the name of a kid who died 30 years ago? Well, that's what we came to find out. The name is John Shepard. It should be on a grave around here somewhere. You never give up, do you? She's convinced she's onto something. And here's me, thinking we're wasting our friggin' time in this friggin' cemetery. The sooner we find that grave, the sooner we can get the hell out of here. I should be investigating Gordy Kramer right about now. And here I am, standing in a cemetery, in pouring rain, looking for the grave of a kid who's been dead for 30 years. What am I, some kind of mook? I hate cemeteries. They depress the hell out of me. Irish plot. Is that a person digging Excuse a grave? I'm looking for the grave of a young boy who died about 30 years ago. His name is John Shepard. You wouldn't know where it is by any chance. The children's graves are in the next plot. Thanks. I've just been wondering. Can I talk to her? Guess not. Gotta hand it to her. That girl is one really determined chick. Chick. Who are you trying to fool? It's cold. It's raining. I'm standing outside getting soaked. Oh, how I love my job. <laughs> this girl knows her mind all right. No point in trying to reason with her. I don't 
Benetaris. Oh, still Benetaris. Parker. Oh, God, come on! Jacqueline Roberts. Ralph Rivera. Shirley Wright. Theodore Brown. Jerry Hernandez. Children Plot. See if she knows. I'm right here. Origami figures. That's one hell of a coincidence. That's right, touch evidence. Yeah. These flowers are fresh. Looks like someone's still tending the grave. Oh, youngin. That one I knew well. You knew John Shepard? I've worked this graveyard nearly all my life. I remember what happened. It was in 77. October. Oh, it's just a flashback. He's drunk again. What are we gonna do? It's pouring rain. We're gonna get soaked if we spend a day outside. Well, this won't get beat. The rain never hurt nobody. Come on, let's go play. Bet you can't catch me! Mom won't be back from work till later. She wouldn't let him treat us like this. Being out in the rain is nothing compared to being in when he's like that. John's right. He can't just stand here all day. Might as well go and play. <laughs> Press the button. I wondered what he was doing. I thought his animation had fucked up then. Up. 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 That way. That way. That way. And. Ooh. Move your ass. I'm, I'm trying, but the six axis is just. Seriously unintuitive. <laughs> 